decreases transportation. There's no need to transport the waste into the landfills. And composting is good for the environment because if you plant a garden using it, there's no need to have fertilizer or to buy commercial soil. So this is the composter for individuals. That's our target market. The individual people, families, people who run a garden in their backyard. One of our educational initiatives was the Green Idea Factory competition, and that is an opportunity for area high school students to compete for scholarship prizes for green and sustainable project ideas and innovations. So we had kids today with everything from recyclable sneakers to solar panels to windmills. The larger windmills that spin this way that you've probably seen in windmill farms, they do make energy but we wanted to be able to chain them together and also look pleasing to people so they reflect light. Some of the projects uh, were definitely ahead of their time and it showed that they went into a lot of research, not just in the engineering side of how it's going to work, but also what are some of the competitors, how much it's going to cost. So they looked into multiple different aspects. The cans that we're making uses five kilograms of petroleum. So it's $90 for a set of two of these cans which go into this. So not only are you saving money, but you're also saving the environment. It takes a thousand years for one bag to decompose. This program is encouraging students to study more science, technology, engineering, and, and math and go into those different fields that we're going to need for the future. Engineering is very important and we need to encourage our students to look at that.